Polk County is running out of water as more and more people move to the area. There is a solution, but this idea may take a while to set in. Yeah, so a pilot plant turns treated wastewater into drinking water. As West 2 Sheldon Dutez explains, county officials will spend the next several years convincing people that it's safe to drink. Coagulation and sedimentation. Polk County leaders want you to know if in several years they send treated wastewater to your faucets, it has been rigorously filtered. They're one three hundredth the size of a human hair, so the water is forced into them. Polk County Utilities Director Tamara Richardson shows us the county's new direct potable reuse pilot plant. A two and a half million dollar project funded by the county and Southwest Florida Water Management District. The water comes from... Yeah, there. It's processed as reclaimed water. Then it arrives at this new facility to be further treated. If something does make it through, this makes it, this inactivates it so it can no longer reproduce. This is the final step. This is just a test. For now, the water treated here is used for lawn irrigation, but officials say the county needs to find a way to produce millions more gallons of drinking water a day to meet demand. Just as there are limited water supplies and space travel, there's also limited water sources here on Earth. Commissioner George Lindsay compares the idea to how they filter water in space, while the county also plans to dig into the lower Floridian aquifer for water. He says using treated wastewater is worth exploring. He knows it may take some persuasion, though. Convincing and, uh, the general public and the elected officials and the regulatory officials that it's a viable process. Sheldon Dutez, West 2 News.